I'm paranoid it's not recording even though everything seems to be working. It happened once before. Oh, now I have five viewers. Bang, instantly. Okay. I guess it's working now. At least it won't be a lost game in the series. <laughs> it almost happened to me once. Like I said, the other time when it was like, I, everything looked good even on my laptop. It looked like I was streaming, and then it turns out I wasn't. And that game's only like three or four turns long, the end of the game, because I didn't realize. <laughs> Oh, I got a knocked out source. I forgot about that. Yeah. Well, you get so many of them, right? It's, you know, one missing one's not the end of the world. <laughs> hmm. Well, I mean, from an, an opponent's standpoint, like as a Lizardman coach, I realize it kind of sucks, but as me, it doesn't make that big a difference to only be you be down one. You've still got plenty, so. Yeah, if I get get another one, that would definitely make it more roomy out there on the pitch. <laughs> I don't think you were supposed to follow, but I, did I have you sandwiched? Oh, I did. Okay. Forgot about that guy. Oh, no, you pushed him over there, didn't you? Okay. Wow, and another turn just whew, gone. These are quick two minute turns, I don't understand. Alright, so now I got one reroll. Now I gotta be a little more careful. So, we're gonna take this because it's two. No. Oh, two with block. I'll take that. Come on, Linda! There you go. Because I have block, that's why I'm blitzing you. That pit bitch is just on fire. She can only do a little bit better than it's done. <laughs> well, she's getting stuns every turn. I'd say that's pretty good. <laughs> She's doing work. She's not useless. Let's put it that way. <laughs> I hate it when they throw blocks and they never get any kind of breaks. That just drives me crazy. Well, the mighty blow pieces, I mean. When you got mighty blow, you expect more, so...
Well, if you do like what you see, even if I beat you or you beat me, uh, my high elf team in the MML Challenge League plays on Thursday. We're going against Nuffles Holy Rollers versus the Swedish Bikini Team. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not the actual Swedish Bikini Team. It's actually a Norris team, so they're not as sexy as it could be. But uh, we sit high atop our conference right now. Two games left in the season. Unfortunately, my last game is against Chaos, so I may not have nothing left for the knockout tournament afterwards, but we'll see. <laughs> He's a buddy of mine. Maybe he'll take it easy on me. Yeah, the skinks with diving tackle, I get it, it's good, but it's such a contradictory to me, because you, you're supposed to keep your skinks away from pieces, right? <laughs> yeah. But they use diving tackle, you gotta stand right next to them, so. I get it, diving tackle's amazing. I had, it, I had a couple of them on a dwarf team once, and it was just, it was so sick. <laughs> For a team like Dwarves, because you want to stand next to everybody, right? So if you could get a doubles and put a diving tackle on a Dwarf, it's just amazing. Uh-oh. Where are we going? Straight ahead. Is that? No, it's still just one. Uh-oh. Unless you do this shit. No, it's still just one. Oh! Look at that! Who is that zombie? Lieutenant number one. Continuing his rivalry with Lieutenant number two saying, Hey, look at me. I'm better than you. You know what, maybe I shouldn't have uh, jumped up with the mummy. I could have taken my blitz out of skink, I guess, but... You know what, can I? Oh, uh, no, I can't do that. can do this, though. Well, that's the plan, isn't it? You go after the skinks and then they can't score. I mean, that's pretty much standard lizardman tactics, isn't it? <laughs> if you're aware of this, but I would like to win as well. So, there's a reason I'm going after them. <laughs> what is that? Oh, that'll work. Hmm. Hmm. If he was the foul skeleton, I would take a crack at a skink, but... He's no, he's got block. I might have use for him. <laughs> he might be of value at some point.
Oh, do you need that assist? I thought you had a two die without it. Oh no, he's four strength, right? Yeah, you need another assist. Yeah, my bad. That's right. I've got the I've got the five strength sword surrounded. That's right. It's the wrong one. <laughs> Oh, he's got catch. Isn't that cute? <laughs> With skinks? <laughs> I suppose you got an agility skink. I suppose it's not as bad as it normally would be. At least I knew where the blitz was coming this time. I knew that was your play. You were going to take a crack at him. Of course, I know where I would like my blitz, but I don't know if I'll get it. <laughs> Obviously, they didn't regenerate one time. <laughs> and that's the downside of the undead team. You kind of, you're stuck with it. Whether you... It's a mummy, too, so it's expensive. It's not like I can just ditch it. Okay, so what does this look like? I want to so bad. I want to blitz with the white, but <laughs> that means I need a I need a dodge as well. I don't like that. I think I'm just gonna. Ah, uh, whoo! Kind of glad I went this route now. Unfortunately, I don't have any rerolls. Here's hoping. Whoops, no. We're, we're going for it. We're going for it. There it is. If it wasn't for GFIs, I could, uh... I could actually win games. <laughs> Yeah, I know, Dan, but I had to stand firm when I got the injury. It's on my list of things to do at some point if, if, if I get there. I will replace him if I get to that point. It's also the lower SPP of the two uh, mummies as well, I believe. Oh, he's MVP range, though. Oh, that's not good. If he levels again, I'm stuck with him. Ooh. 
Well, just these are series for YouTube, right? It's 20 games with is the series, and so I only play 20 games with each iteration of the team, right? Like I've got Norris is done, Chaos is done, Skaven is done, High Elves are done, and I have an ongoing Lizardman and Undead, so I kind of keep it to with 20 games, right? So there's a little bit of um, adjusted mentality. Like if it was just playing forever, obviously I would fire him and just do it at some point. But I've got a level on him. He's not completely useless. Yeah, but when, when he got the injury, he was one of my only two levels on the team. So I couldn't fire him then. He was too useful. Or one of my only two or three levels, yeah. Now I could probably fire him. No, if he had block, he wouldn't go anywhere. Eight armor's not that bad. I mean, other big guys have eight armor, so... It's not the end of the world. Now, obviously, he's in a precarious position. If he ever got another minus to armor, he'd be instantly fired. <laughs> I can't have a seven armor value big guy. He's slow. Yep, he is. Oh, are they both down? Oh, they're both down. That sucks. Lodge mummy. Obviously, I would love to have a reroll for this, but... <laughs> uh. Got to at that point. No reason not to. <laughs> He's more useful over there than he is standing next to that croc or that source. So. God damn it. Pushes. Ugh. Well, to be fair, I only had like a one out of three chance of that being working, so. Science. Oh, it's science. The eight value, the eight armor value mummy is science. That's why I need to get rid of them. I will lose games. I probably will. But like I said, I'm in a position now. I can cut them. So I'm I actually just might cut them. I think I have a lot of money too. Again, provided he doesn't suck up the MVP for this game, that could happen. All right, here we need a miracle. Probably not going to get it, but... Mm -hmm. 
Agility skinks fail less than elves. <laughs> when it comes to the dodging. When it comes to dodging out, they fail less than elves, I find. I hardly ever see one fail a dodge out of something. Wow, it did fail the first one. But that's why they have dodge. Here's where we need failure. Oh. Oh, come on. Not full. Make it interesting. Burn that reroll. There it is. Burn it. Burn it. Yes! Unfortunately, nobody... Oh, no, I've got one guy. Okay. Oh, are you just too far to score now? You're too far to score. Yes. Okay, so I'm not going to get scored on. That's nice, I guess. And I can take a triple die at this skink. Oh, let's go. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I got a double on this one too, right? Yep. Actually, I got a surf maybe. Nope, I don't. It doesn't matter, you can't score, so. <laughs> oh, wait, is that the right? Okay, yeah, it is. No, you're one movement shy, so I'm not worried. Yeah, no. Let's not do that. <laughs> Let's take this route, if we're going to take any route at all. That's what got me. I, I, I was hoping the pass would fail. I figured you'd make the catch. <laughs> But I resisted temptation. I'm so proud of myself. I still have my wizard for the second half. <laughs> I didn't really realize it till just now, but you did roll really well that half. You burned one reroll. <laughs> Well, no, you, uh, you didn't have any situations where you were forced to. Like, everything was pretty much an okay, acceptable outcome, right? You didn't take any vanity ones or anything like that, so. Like me on turn one, which I wish I could take back. But. Hoping I get my mummy back. You know, I have to say KOs are worse than injuries on this team. Because KOs can stay down the whole game easy enough. <laughs> I 
I know they're not. I know you only get one crack at the injury, but... Oh! So, he's down to 10 for sure, possibly 9. I have a bench, so I currently I'll have a full team. Or not, actually. Maybe. Oh, sidestep. Yay! Could Thick Skull be... Oh, I don't know. Maybe if you got up to, like, level 6 or 7 with a mummy, maybe Thick Skull would be nice. But to guard against KOs. Ouch. Alright. She's good. Alright, let's see how the KOs go. Yes! Woo! Oh, and I got my mummy too. Nice. Couldn't have worked out much better. It makes more sense to me because they both have stand firm so they can guard the sideline. And let's face it, how often do you see grab on opponents' teams? Like, you never see it, so. I mean, you're kind of wasting one of your big advantages of your team as your disposable players. Why wouldn't you throw three zombies up there, like, every single time? I guess it depends on the team. Like, maybe with a team without a big guy or something like elves, maybe you'd want your mummies up there, but... In this situation, I'm just giving you cracks at my good pieces with your good pieces. It doesn't make any sense at all. You can easily out-muscle me with Saurus, so... I normally would have put all block up on the line, but you have block on all your pieces pretty much, so I might as well just fire up my disposable ones and keep my block pieces for something else. Let's! Can I get a skink? Ooh. Mm, it's near the ball too. That's I'm kind of really tempted. I might just give me a sec. I'll just set up the rest of the board first.
Mm. I didn't block myself, did I? No, I didn't. See? I can still get there. I suppose I could go for the ball, too. But, uh... You know, the ball makes more sense. Alright, hold on. Oh, am I gonna regret not going after this skink? We'll see. Alright, I made one. I made two. This is why I wanted to hit the skank. I figured I, the catch is only 50-50, and I don't want to burn a reroll on it. <laughs> now I feel like I should have hit the skank. <laughs> You've got problems though, I'll give you that much. <laughs> Your front line's completely covered. Your two lone source are also covered by mummies. Yeah. And I'm just throwing this out there because I feel proud of myself for once. I could always wizard if, if you get the ball, so. <laughs> I'm actually in a good position for once. And see, normally I wouldn't have my wizard. I'd just be complaining about my fireball in the first half, but. <laughs> yeah. Now I might actually get some use out of it, which would be amazing. <laughs> Nice. Oh wow, I didn't see that. Oh, okay. Gonna put some responsibility in his hands, eh? <laughs> GFI. No, you're going straight. You're not making any turns. <laughs> oh, you are? Oh, he is. Oh, there it is! And the loner. Uh, actually, TB regeneration's working out great so far. I've just had the one kind of crappy one with this mummy here on armor value, but otherwise it's worked out really good. They're definitely not shit like the trolls. I'll say that much. <laughs> the troll never regenerated. I don't know what the fuck was going on with that thing, but... Oh! Number two. Evil Ash getting in on the action. Whoa, no, no. Stay in here. Oh, uh, chat's asking what you think about Undead. Do you think they're balanced? I think they're pretty balanced. Yeah, 
Hmm. Yeah, I had somebody trying to tell me the other day that mummies were overrated, and I was like, how is that again? <laughs> I think mummies are pretty good. Exactly. They're, they're, if you're going to call them a big guy, they're like the best one, because there's no negative trait. I didn't cover up the ball as much as I probably should have. Instead, I went for that five strength source. But my reasoning is I still have my wizard. <laughs> so if it all goes to shit, I can still maybe bail myself out. Because I'm, I'm not blind. I do see that the agility skink is right there. But we are down to two skinks. Oh! Woo. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty happy about that. I was kind of worried about him too, but... <laughs> I didn't think you were gonna burn your blitz on him, and you didn't, but he still could have been pretty useful. That tail would have given me problems. Next to the ball, if you're not like a 4 agility team, that tail is a big, big problem. He's gonna bust out of his confinement. Oh, big time. From what I understand, Undead's worst matchup is probably Skaven or Lizardman. Because of uh, the durability and the speed. With Lizardman and with Skaven, they just ridiculous speed. They can't handle it. So, But definitely faster teams. They're kind of like, um, they're kind of human team, really. They're almost like a mirror match to a human team. Because they don't really excel... In a whole lot of places, but they don't have a whole lot of deficiencies either. And the movement's crazy. You've literally got a 3, a 4, a 5, a 6, and a 7 movement piece on a team. <laughs> Which can be tough to manage. Alright, here's where I need you to shine. Okay, that was not shiny at all. That was pretty fucking terrible, actually. <laughs> hey, that's better, though. Hit him in the face! Right, with the AV7, yeah, you can you can hurt them, for sure. But, um... The reason why Skaven are a really bad matchup is because the speed. They're so fast. Even the linemen have 7 speed, right? Like... Your worst player is as fast as as Undead's best player. That's why Skaven is such a terrible matchup. Yeah. Uh, he's definitely uh, favorable. Oh, here we go. Ah. Uh, well, that was not what I envisioned. <laughs> it's not. 
It's not terrible, but it's not what I was hoping for. I can still make it work. So there's... In case there's a problem in two turns, I'll be there to help. Oh, Evil Ash with the touchdown. No, I'm not passing that up. If I can give away a touchdown, he's getting it. Yeah, it was, well, it's a toss-up. And I went with uh, Stan Firm and... Maybe you missed the start of the half, but the reason I did it is because I, now I can block the outside lanes with my two mummies. Like, see how it's set up right now? That's the reason I took stand for him over guard. I don't want them on the line. I'm going to use trash on the line. And I still have my wizard, I know. It's amazing, eh? I don't know how that's possible, but it is. But yeah, TB, this is why. So they can stand right here and guard the outside lines. That's a big problem to have five strength out there by itself. Most teams can't handle it. This is one of the teams that can, though. I mean, if block... If they, if they could pick general skills, obviously I'd have block first and then stand firm. But uh, Tackle would be a nice addition there, too, for Skaven and stuff to try and sneak by. But obviously I'm going to take Block over Tackle, so... Oh! That's bad news for the Skinks. <laughs> Easy. I love the zombie animation, how they almost fall over. It's hilarious. It's like a drunk front line. They're all hammered. It's the only way they can stand in front of all that lizard. Look how they're, they're doing the wave. Woo, one, two. Oh no, the other one's not in sync. It's like a half. Oh! Wow. Oh, oh my God. Well, on the plus side, the ball was fairly well protected at least, so... I don't think I could have gotten it very easily. If at all. Because yeah. obviously the big negatives on Undead is there's like zero passing game. And you have no passing. And, um, ball handling skills. Like, nobody gets sure hands to start with, so... I mean, my ghouls are all... I got a blodge on all my ghouls, I'm pretty happy. Now I'm gonna start taking different paths. Like, I put sidestep on one, I think the next one I'm gonna go sure hands. Yeah, 
and mix them up. I have a little variety now. Now that they're all as survivable as they're gonna get, so. <laughs> Pretty ambitious. <laughs> yeah, <good> <laughs> oh, you know what? I put him. Uh, I screwed that up. Yeah, I screwed that up. I'm gonna need you. What just fucking happened there? Oh, it didn't fucking... Oh, I hate that. Every once in a while, um, yeah, the stick doesn't work. I hate that. say it's user error but it's controller error that happens every once in a while you hit the stick and it doesn't do what you want it to thank you for the push Close, but no cigar. Uh, isn't it amazing? Just one, like, error and just everything falls apart. <laughs> I'm gonna get broken here too. No? Oh, I really thought I would. So where can you go? Uh, I got problems. Patience. <laughs> Let's 
Funny, I just said patience, and then I just stood up two guys, and I didn't mean to. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, and I just I jumped the gun as always. Um Now obviously I don't want to go that way. Can I get to here? Nope. I have to cut that corner. So, yeah, I don't, uh, you know, I guess I'm going to see if my lightning bolt can help me score. Because <laughs> this will probably fail. Oh, wow, he made it. I mean, he made the dodge. I was worried about the dodge. <laughs> I got a reroll for the GFI. Oh, no, we got double ones. Awesome. <laughs> uh, I can believe it. <laughs> Anybody who watches this series can believe it. Or these series I do. I get double ones all the time. And it's always at the worst possible moments, too. Well, you can take your touchdown or you're gonna do some blocks. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's it's a guarantee if you don't score this time you're getting blasted for sure. There's no scenario where that doesn't happen. So <laughs> Cuz now my white's in position. <laughs> yeah, your agility does not make him better at catching the ball. <laughs> wow, I'm a little surprised. Especially with a GFI. We just saw double ones on. Well, not this time, though. I know you did. That's why I'm happy now. Oh shit, I didn't use the wizard again. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. How do I... Uh, keep doing this kind of shit. That helps a lot though, I'm not gonna lie. Now there's nobody else to back up picking up the ball. 
I'm not sure where I want to stand though, that's the problem. <laughs> standing next to you, that's for sure. break. Oh, that sucks. You can still score real easy. Yeah, it's done. That's all I needed. Just a stun. You got four agility. Yeah, you are. <laughs> like, this doesn't even matter. It's all just going to come down to you picking it up and getting away from me, which is not going to be that hard. This is more about insurance than anything. Damn it. Just a stun. That's all I needed. Obviously a KO is pretty much a win, but... <laughs> I mean, at that point, you're hoping a source picks up the ball and runs it in, right? So... <laughs> Yeah, so you don't even need a GFI. Hey. Oh! Holy shit. Holy shit. Just a push. I'm happy. That'll work. <sighs> More double ones. Oh, this is sick. This is so sick. That's honestly your best play to score. Like, blitzing my ghoul is going to do nothing. Unless you dodge out and blitz the other one. That's the only play, but that's so low probability of working. Yeah, if you dodge out. But, I mean... Even if the dodge works, if you got to push, that's disastrous too, right? So... Or it doesn't improve anything for the risk of the not dodging, so. Ah, let's see, there's that too. Well, at least you got a reroll. <laughs> for all good they've done. Oh, there it is. God damn it. Another one I feel like I should have won, but fucking dice. <laughs> Double ones. Oh, now there's another skink. 
You do only have one turn, so I guess I don't have to worry about you scoring. And you get all your swords back, that's a problem. I think I know what the play is going to have to be, but I don't like it. See, it's another reason I feel like I let one slip away. <laughs> the GFIs, the double ones, it's been pretty sick. Just, wow. But I mean, just the double ones all around. We, we both had three or four each. Like it was pretty sick. I know I'm not scoring. <laughs> well, I was gonna have to make some kind of pass, and now without a reroll, I don't see it happening. So. And double ones. So GG. I don't know. Yeah, no. Well, you should have loaded up towards the back of the line, right? Because it would have taken me a turn to set up and then 
But as it turns out, it doesn't matter. Nobody's getting good rolls this game, so. <laughs> kind of irrelevant. I mean, yeah, I could score technically with him, but I think it's more valuable to protect your skink. <laughs> oh no, he went down. Because I would have needed to not only pick up without a reroll, uh, maybe a handoff play, and then a throw into coverage, and then dodge out and make two GFIs. I just, no, it's not happening. <laughs> Is that less than 1%, probably? <laughs> Yeah, I thought about it. I was like, nah, I'll eat it. Fuck it. <laughs> I may be firing him anyway. Get it all. Look at that. Close. I I knew it was coming. It's fine. Because this is coming. Yeah, well, it's like I said, I may fire him after this game, so I'm not overly worried about it. Oh, well, I'm gonna get a shot at a level here. Let's hope. <laughs> Oh, he did it! Level! <laughs> he, he, he. No. GG. <laughs> yep. So again, I feel like that one slipped away. Rolls, though. I mean, I couldn't do anything about that. You just get double ones all the time. You're not going to win much. But thankfully, we were in a position where we were only going to suffer a tie. Two injuries. We got two skinks, but not four. God, if we could have just had a lightning bolt, just had it did something, anything. I think we would have been all right. But as it were, it did not. Wow, he actually threw more blocks than I did. That's a little surprising. Evil Ash and Ash. Evil Ash with a touchdown, which is awesome. Did I? Oh yeah, we got a level. Woo. This will probably be our sure hands ghoul. 
So I'm not sure what the other one was going to be, but the other one's far away. General, so sure hands. Boom. So we got some reliable pickup, and we got some reliable, uh, definitely some survivability on this one. But that's going to do it for game 10 in 20 games with Undead. I am Darren. Thanks for watching.